We're here at the link for this matchup between the Baltimore Ravens and the Philadelphia Eagles. Back in your days when you had to take on a team from the AFC, didn't know them all that well. What was it like as we have this little interconference matchup today? Well, I thought back in those days, Jim, we were about ready to show them what toughness and hard hitting was. Uh, today it's a little different, but I'll tell you this, this NFC team, they are a hard hitting bunch. Ravens getting set to kick it away. That'll be a touchback, and the ball will be placed at the 20. They bring in an extra defensive back. First and ten. Scrambling out of the pocket. And he's going to be tackled right around the 31-yard line. Nice job by the offense picking up that first down here to start the game. And that is important to give you a little confidence, to give you some rhythm, and most of all, just release some of that pressure you feel. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. And he's taken down. I got to blame the offensive line that time. Giving up a sack early in a game like that. You cannot take chances. Don't overplay as an offensive lineman. If you do it, you give up a sack. Look at that. The defensive line, everybody's shifting to the right. Quarterback dropping back, looking to get the feet planted. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. Good job that time by the quarterback. Man-to-man -man coverage down the field. When you see it, you've got to be accurate with the football. He was that time, and that's why we got the completion. First down here after the completion. They give it to the running back. Fumble. tackle was made that was just a terrible job by the offensive player that time protect the football no excuse for letting it uh, fumbling the football in a situation like that the safety up in the box here out of the gun Looking for an open receiver on the right. Interception. And he's brought to the ground. Now when the defense gets an interception early in the game, oh, man, will that give them confidence. And it just makes them play more aggressive. So this is a very good start for the defense. They need to get the playoff. That's going to be a timeout charge to the offense.
Here they come, back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. He's brought down at the 23-yard line. Jim, that was some job of making the catch and holding on to the football. You could hear that hit all the way up here in the booth. Nickel formation for the defense here. Second down and 10. Vix looking long. Makes a spectacular diving grab. You throw it deep for a lot of reasons. One, you're hoping for the big play, maybe a touchdown, but also you got to think about interference. You can get that a lot of times, but that was a nice throw and catch. The offense coming to the line inside the opponent's 20. Got a flag. Player showing no restraint coming in on the quarterback, and that late hit will cost his team 15. A lot of times these late hits are called, and I, I feel for the defensive player. Not in this case. That was an easy call. A blatant late hit. It's worthy of 15 yards. Alex Henry ready for the kickoff. They'll take it at the 20. Baltimore Ravens come on to the field for their next series. First down on the way. Oh, look at that. The defensive line shifted over to the left. Play action fake and dropping back the throw. Airtight coverage, incomplete. That was excellent man-to-man -man coverage that time. When you want to shut down a receiver, really the only way to do it is to man up and play him one-on-one. -on -one. Failing to complete that one. So second down here. He'll fire it out to the left. Breaks away, runs out of bounds. Good job by the play caller that time. Calling for the short pass, even though it comes up short of the first down, it opens up many things that you can do on third. You can run a reverse, draw plays, screen plays, or if you want, you can still throw it down the field. Playing press coverage to the outside. Now looking at third down. Good job here by the quarterback. He doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. Not giving up another inch. Nothing like a receiver who can just put his head down and go after the football. That's what he did that time. Nice throw by the quarterback. Watch the receiver at the last second looks up and makes the catch. This play set up by the long gainer. Now first and ten. Play action. Quarterback has it on his hip. And now looking to throw. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football. And it leads to another incomplete pass. Here's the safety inching up for this play. From the shotgun, looking for a receiver on the left side here. Touchdown, and that'll close the gap in this one. Well, that score ties the game up. Now on the defensive side, you've got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. Defense. That's what happens when you try to guess the snap count. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. They bring him to the turf.
Play clock's running down. And the offense will call a timeout. Defense comes out in the nickel. First and ten. Trying to work that left side. The pass is incomplete. There was no one open. I think that's the hardest pass a defensive back has to defend. The long throws down the field. You have to wait to the last second to make your play. That time the defensive back did it. What a play. Split backfield here. Drop back, shotgun formation. Chat. Kerry Williams has the pick. He's into the open. Got what he wanted. Touchdown. Well, the quarterback was under pressure. He could not see the defender. The defender in the right spot makes the catch and takes it back for a touchdown. Extra point is good. Ravens getting set to kick it away. Deshaun Jackson with a chance here on the kickoff. Good piece of tackle. Eagles are getting set for their next possession. The quarterback's hollering out instructions. The defense comes out of the dime. From the gun. He'll fire it out to the left. Squeezes it into coverage. And that'll close the gap. There's no doubt about it. When you score like that to tie up the game, it shifts momentum. And it's all up now to the offense of the other team to get back out there and get the momentum back on their side. Lining up now for the two. Looking to the right side and throwing. And they will not convert here on the two-point conversion. Good stand by the defense. The Ravens' return team is ready. He's brought down at the 23-yard line. the safety here moving up at the last moment go, go, go. Go, go, go. look at the cushion they have off of these receivers working that left side the defense did not give up an inch what a good job by the defensive back that time that ball was thrown beautifully down the field high arcing throw but the defensive back in great position knocks it down Offense lines up here. Second and ten. The quarterback throws to the right. That's a gain of six. Good job by the quarterback that time. Makes the decision. Throws it short. It does not get the first down. But I promise you, 
third and short is a lot easier than having third and long. Quarters formation here for the defense. Third down and four. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Got to give the secondary credit. In this passing league now, it's hard to make plays, but a good play there in another incomplete pass. The punter awaits the snap. Split Good. backfield Good. here. Good. First down and ten. Vix looking long. Reaches in, swats it away. They call that the moment of truth. It's a beautiful throw down the field, but the defensive back, he waits until it's time to make that jump. He defends the pass. What a good hey, job of the defensive back. Here, hey, a split nice backfield. Second down and ten. And he's thrown to the ground. You know, when you get sacked like that, it just comes down the quarterback. You uh, hate to put all the pressure on him, but you have to know it. In this league, the rules, you can throw it away, so no use holding on to that football and taking those hits, and most importantly, and losing those yards and putting your team in a tough position. These big receivers in the NFL now, they can get down the field and just give them a chance. That's what the quarterback good, did. Good, good. Nice catch by the receiver. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. First and ten. Running away from the sack. That picks up seven. Fifteen minutes down, 45 minutes to go. Back after this word from your local station. And welcome back as we're about to get underway here in this one. Second down here. That's a pass all the way. Jeremy Macklin makes the grab. As good as it gets. Touchdown wide receivers they are turned into stars in the nfl you know why because they can make catches like this what a great catch they're gonna bypass the point after and try to pick up the two-point conversion and so they convert it here on the two-point drive They want the football back as they line up now in an onside kick formation. The onside kick is turned away and the receiving team has it. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Snap back to the quarterback, out of the gun. And that ball's nearly picked off, but he dropped it. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. Second down following that incompletion. Takes the stab from the shotgun. Flacco flings it. Wait, and it's picked off by Rogers Cromarty. He stacked up at that point. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. Hey, let's go. 
split backfield here. They'll go shotgun here. Going across the middle. He fires it in there tight. That's a good job by the quarterback recognizing it's man-to-man -man defense. And when you see that, just watch the receiver leading to the open space. Nice completion. Here's the first snap after the big play. Now first and ten. Courtney Upshaw brings the quarterback down. Nice job that time to the outside linebacker getting the sack. They ask a lot of these guys now. They are special players in the NFL. Stopping the run and the speed to get outside and get the sacks on the quarterback too. The formation here, shotgun. Getting sacked again. What a job, gets in there for the second straight play, gets the sack. He is just so big, fast, and strong, hard to block this guy one-on-one. -on -one. Throwing now to his left, Jeremy Macklin makes the grab. Nice job that time by the defense, knowing the situation. Go ahead and let the quarterback complete the pass. Just make sure you come up and make the tackle before the first down. Good job. Fourth down coming up. This is a five-step drop back. He brings it in here, and he's got the first. Well, it's another first down for the offense, and I'll tell you who the happiest guys are here in this stadium right now. It's the defensive players sitting over on the sideline, getting a drink of water, having a little oxygen, the fan blowing on them. It's nice this time of day to be a defender. First and ten. Trying to work the middle of the field. The defense doubled up on that one. He's such a smart linebacker. That's one of the reasons why he was able to knock that pass down that time. He diagnosed the play. He saw what it was going to be, got himself in position, and he made it happen. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Second and ten. Looking across the middle, under fire on that throw. Nice job that time by the defense. Pressure on the quarterback. He does not have time to find an open guy, and it results in an incompletion. Hey, let's go, base 24. This will be the eighth play of this drive. The throw to the left. Jeremy Macklin takes the grab. They're across midfield with that play. When you have an offense like this that just keeps getting first downs, not only are they moving in scoring position, but they're giving their defense a lot of rest. There's the quarterback barking out new signals. The quarterback throws the pass. That pass well defended. Not much you can say about that incompletion. The receiver was open. The quarterback just made a bad throw. Good decision, but a terrible throw. Hey, let's go. That is play number 10 on this drive. Eyeing that left side. Good throw and good catch right on the sideline. Good job by the offense. Get another first down. You can tell by looking down on the field that defense hands on their knees. They are getting tired. That play is going to be challenged. There is the red flag. So the challenge pays off. The referee overturns the play. Yeah, good challenge by the coach that time, Jim. The evidence was clear. And always, I think when you're a head coach in the NFL, you better have a trusted friend up there to tell you, watch the TV, and let you know when the challenge. Good job by the head coach. Play number 12 coming up for the offense. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Ladarius Webb with an interception. Knocked out of bounds. Right, well, I have to say that's just a terrible decision by the quarterback there. He's got to know when you're in a situation like this, you just cannot make that type of pass. They look like they're loaded up for the blitz here. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Rice. Good job by the defensive line. Standing in there and fighting. And they hold the running back to a short game. Check, check, check. 
that last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. Safety valve time. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. Zone defense doesn't work in the NFL like it used to. Good job by the quarterback reading that zone and finding the open guy. Blitz is in the air. Corners formation here for the defense. Corners are backing off here. He'll throw it over the middle. No separation at all. Incomplete. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to uh, make the football be incomplete. They're in punting formation. Jackson's going to try and return this punt. And he's taken out of bounds. That was a terrible job by the punt team. You got to hustle down there and get near the punt returner and make a tackle. The Eagles getting set now for the next series. Great starting field position for the offense. First down and 10. And he wants to throw it across the middle. And almost picked off. Roughing the passer, defense. Roughing the passer call gives the offense 15 yards and a new set of downs. Yeah, and it was a, it was a terrible roughing the passer that time. He absolutely took two steps before he hit the quarterback. You can right see when he lets the ball go. When you see him let it go, pull up. There's a player down on the field. Trainers on their way out. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but and don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. From the red zone. Second and long. Going across the middle. Great coverage there on that pass attempt. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football, and it leads to another incomplete pass. The quarterback's calling something out. Split backfield here, out of the shotgun formation. Eagles in the end zone. It's commonplace now. It's hard to even say the word great for a catch by the wide receiver. We see so many of them. But this one, that is a great catch. Inside of the uprights. Eagles getting set for the kickoff. This kick will stay on the ground, avoiding a big return. begins for the offense with a very good chance to score. And it's Ed Reed who makes the tackle. The margin of error against man-to-man -man defense is much smaller for a quarterback than it would be against zone defenses. That time the quarterback right on target. Good throw. Good, good, good. The offense looking down the field. The promised land so close by. Here's the give to LaShawn McCoy to the right. Scores the touchdown. Well, there's an old saying in the NFL. You know how I many points? You need, and the answer is more. So no matter what the lead is, keep trying to score. Nice job by the offense getting that extra touchdown. Lining up now for the extra point. Makes the PAT. And after that extra point, the Eagles lead by 21. 
They're lining up for the onside kick. They want to get the ball back. That kick came right at him, and it looks like the receiving team has recovered. Something we've seen from the safety before. Ready to pounce on the snap. First and ten. Trying to work the middle of the field. He's got the grab, and he's got the first. This quarterback runs so well, he just expects that they're going to have a spy on him. Well, that's good. You might stop him from running now, but the problem is he can still throw it down the field on him. Now first and ten. Looking across the middle, makes the reception. Anytime you get in the red zone, you want to punch it in there and get seven points. Uh, they're being dominated today. They're down more than seven. But don't worry about it. Score here and just keep playing. The offense getting set. The goal line in sight. Looks to his left. And it's off the mark. Second down coming up. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Pushes aside one tackler. A lot of ways where the offense can go this time. They can run it, or throw it, and even if they score, they're still going to be down, but it's always great to execute the play the right way. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Handoff to Ray Rice getting harder and harder in the NFL to score when you're this close to the check, goal line. Check, check. So what will the offense do? Go, go, they, go. they better be creative. That's all I know. Watch check, the safety. Check, He's go. creeping up. Another handoff. A tackle behind the line. Well, anytime you're in the red zone, you want to punch it in and get that touchdown. If they do that, look, they're still, they're still going to be behind, but it gives them confidence moving forward. This has got to be a blitz. Look how everybody's crowding the line of scrimmage. Play number six coming up on this drive. Dominique Rogers Cromarty makes that big off. He's brought to a halt. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. Here, a split backfield. First and ten. He'll fire it out to the left. Throws a strike. Good job by the receiver that time. Getting that extra couple yards. Gets a first down. They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. The quarterback mixing things up at the line of scrimmage. The quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. The ball's deflected incomplete. That's what you have to do as a defensive back. you got to wait to the last second. Wait till the receiver uses his hands. And once they go up, put your hand in between them and knock that football down. What a play. Ready for intermission. First, one more play. From the gun. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. No one was open. Got to give this secondary credit. In this passing league now, it's hard to make plays, but a good play there in another incomplete pass. We're back here now in this one, where the Eagles lead by 21. They're not going to risk the big return, so here's the squid kick. And the tackle is made at the 35-yard line. The Baltimore Ravens come onto the field now for this next series. 
Quarters formation here for the defense. Looking to the right side and throwing. When you're going against a good quarterback and wide receiver in the NFL now, one of the ways to stop it is tight man-to-man -man coverage. You against him. Check, check, check. The quarterback has his team's attention here. That leads us to second down. And the give now to Ray Rice. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Hurry up, two-minute offense. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Play fake here. That ball was going the other way. Good job by the defensive back. Reading the wide receiver, makes the break at the perfect time, and gets the interception. The defense comes out of the nickel. First down and 10. And the quarterback is taken down. Beautiful timing that time by the safety. That's what it's about when you talk about blitzing. Space the field properly so the safety has a lane to run into and timing the snap of the ball. They did everything right that time. Good job of the safety getting that sack. Second down coming up. Takes it from the eye. He's brought down at the 46. They're going no huddle. The off-tackle run, it's just what it says it is. You're going to read the tackle's block and decide whether you're going to go inside or outside. Usually, this is the first running play every team puts in their offense when they go to training camp. I think that's the hardest pass a defensive back has to defend. The long throws down the field. You have to wait to the last second to make your play. That time the defensive back did it. What a play. Hey, let's go base 24. How about this? They're trying to base pick 24. up the first down on fourth down. Forgetting the punt. The quarter. Ball's picked off. What a terrible <laughs> job by the quarter. Nobody's open, tries to force the pass, and look, what's it turn into? An interception. The safety is up in the box right now. Out of the gun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Well, I guess the best thing to say there, Jim, is they completed the pass, but he still did not get a first down. The safety near the line of scrimmage. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Ravens now move the chains. And he's knocked out of bounds. You know, in the NFL now, the defenses have to be smart when it's a long situation where you think they might throw it deep down the field. When they throw it short, you have to react, you have to break down, spread the field, and make the tackle. Come on. After the long game, let's see what they do here. First and 10. The quarterback throws the pass. Jim, the coaches tell us the same thing every week about defenses. Can we hold them to field goal tries and not give up the touchdowns? Here we are, they got more than a seven point lead. Can you hold them until a field goal try? Well, we'll find out. Second and four, play action fake, looking to throw. That's a touchdown and that tightens things up. Nowadays, so many kids, they grow up, they want to be wide receivers. I don't blame them. They're out there, they get to catch the football, they get to score touchdowns, they get to do dances, and you're not really allowed to hit them either. What a job. And the point after is good. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. Bringing the play to an end.
They face first down. He drops back to throw. He'll throw it over the middle. Ball's thrown incomplete. Great coverage there by the defense. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. And they sack the quarterback. Loss of eight. Defense comes to the line, ready to pounce on that quarterback one more time. Can they get another sack right here? The tackle's going to be made, but he's beyond the first down marker. The defense thinks they have the guys to play man-to-man -man coverage down the field. Well, they didn't that time. The receiver made a nice little move, gets open, and a good throw by the quarterback. Staying with the passing game on first down. Well, the protection was bad. The quarterback didn't have the time. He's off balance, and he throws the incompletion. Quarterback sees something in his defense he wants to take advantage of. Look at the hand signals he's given to the receiver outside. Right where it had to be. The big skin's on the ground. Well, the one thing we know about the NFL, when you have the football in your hands, they are going to attack it. You've got to know that as a ball carrier, protect it a lot better. Ravens, get ready to start their drive. Corners formation here for the defense. The corners step back. Now first and ten. Flacco flings. Asimov picks off that pass. Shove to the sideline. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback side. They got in position and they made the interception. What a beating this has been as he comes to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a ninth time today. McCoy now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. When you run off tackle, one of the things you're looking for is for your tackle to make a good block, and then if you have a lead fullback, can he get past him and block the linebacker to free up the halfback so he can go in between them and get into secondary and make a big play. Trying to work that left side. No way that would be completed. What a good job by the defensive back that time. That ball was thrown beautifully down the field. High arcing throw, but the defensive back in great position knocks it down. And let's go base 24. Good job here by the quarterback. He doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. Not sure why they're going to go for it at this point, but they are. They're not going to punt. Challenging the defenders to the right side. They fail to convert here on fourth down. That was a terrible job that time by the offense. The head coach decides to go for it on fourth down. Uh, the play is there. The players just did a terrible job of executing. What a place to start for the offense. Rice. And he'll go to the left. That's a gain of seven. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Second and three. Staying on the ground. And that'll be a gain of about two. You got to keep your offensive line aggressive. So you got to let them run the football so they can hit those defensive linemen. The run didn't pick up any yards, but it still served the purpose. It'll be third down. They'll run with it again. 
the tackle was made, but the first down is picked up. Even though the defense knows you're probably going to run the football, it's third and short. If you run hard, all you need is a little bit of a lane. We see it there, able to get the first down. Quarters formation here for the defense. They'll stay on the ground on first down. The safety up in the box here. What 20? What 20? 15 minutes to go. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. We welcome you back to the action as the fourth quarter is about to begin. This will be second down. From the shotgun. He'll fire it out to the left. That ball is picked off. Makes a move and gets around the defender. That interception is strictly on the quarterback. When you make bad decisions, I don't care how good you can throw the football. The results, usually it's going to turn into an interception. It's first down as they head to the line. They give it to the back, and he's running off tackle. Takes it the distance for the touchdown. Now you know why running backs get drafted high. Because these long running plays for... Uh, uh,